Hello, my soccer universe. Yes, it's quite dark here. I'm talking a little bit quiet because it's really late, but I just finished watching the highlights of the Women's World Cup. And to be honest, um, if you look at the schedule for tomorrow, it's better I do this video now to have it out on time. So and I'll take it in a good nap. I know there's a Copa America coming as well. So I'm getting a little bit quite busy here. Uh, I hope you saw the first uh, jersey review for the Women's World Cup. I hope the second one is out on Sunday, so we'll see that. I'm wearing my Italy shirt because Italy keeps on winning and we again will do it by group and not how they were played. The Italy game was the second game and I actually saw um, quite some of it live, not super attentively because when I put the uh, started it was already 2-0, but uh, two goals by Cristiana Girelli first one the penalty that had to be retaken and the first time it was saved by uh, Sidney Schneider, the great Jamaican goalkeeper already saved the penalty from uh, Brazil but you gotta say I mean she's speculating she's jumping early um, so Girelli has to retake the penalty goes in the other direction she again jumps in the same direction she would have saved that one too I mean she's a tall woman so um, makes it easy for her 1-0 Italy, Italy off to a good start, they get the second one again to Girelli and it seems every time Italy has a scorer they need to score at least two, uh, goes off her belly into the net um, quite easily, makes it to nil and right after the restart uh, Der Schneider made a uh, goalkeeping mistake, I mean it's a whole cross in, she tries to catch in Girelli who is smaller than her, she's just saying the ball falls on her head and goes into the net, it was really weird, bad goalkeeping error. So it's 3-0 Italy and basically it's the game is done, Italy can hold back, maybe the run of play was a little bit in favor but Italy was overall the better team. Uh, Bunny Shaw only she's the star for Jamaica and basically the only uh, player that you want to watch she only was seen because of a yellow card and Italy gets two more goals by Aurora Galli two by her notice a the theme Girelli now has three Bonansea from the first game against Australia has two and Galina also gets two both of them wonderful goals the first one I have uh, shot from quite a distance, like 20 meters out, right into the corner. I mean, the goalkeeper was there, really nicely done. And the second one, a deadly pass, and she can run the goalkeeper and run into the net. Those were two of the best goals, even the best goals scored at this World Cup. Uh, and Italy is my big surprise. I'm very happy about it. I mean, proudly wearing my Italy shirt. But yeah, they secured a spot in the next round already, having six points. Uh, Brazil and Australia now at three points, um, again because Brazil played Jamaica goal differential better for them, Jamaica more or less out of it. Let's go to group D, so this settles group C. Uh, in group D the early game was kind of the super pink matchup, um, you know Japan is playing the blue but they have some pink highlights and Scotland played in all pink with white shorts, uh, quite a sight to see. Um, it was more or less all Japan from what I see. I mean, Eva Bucci gets a goal in 23rd and they get a penalty. They hit the woodwork. Uh, only when La uh, Lana Cleland pulls one back, I think again a wide range shot um, in the uh, late, late in the second half, you thought there might be something going, but in the end, Japan gets the win that they needed. Uh, didn't see anything of the match. I really wanted to watch England against Argentina and no one here in the German speaking area was showing that one. Um, it was another one of those, uh, you know, Ar England, Argentina in the men's game is a big fight in the women's game. There's nothing there yet. My biggest surprise there was that England was playing as the home team in red and Argentina were playing in their uh, regular kit with the steel blue shorts, which I don't like. But the red kit of England, that's a sight to behold. And to be honest, if I would have my red England kit hanging here, I would be wearing now the red England because I've been wearing this uh, Italy shirt already. But no, I feel more confident with my Italy shirt. It was all England. England had a penalty that was actually saved. A really nice save act, actually. I mean, she's jumping right corner and can push it against the post and get out. This was a really nice 
England, I think, also hit the woodwork. Um, had many chances in the end. Jody Taylor makes in the 61st uh, the decisive goal for a well-deserved victory. Uh, I was looking a few times at the scores and it was nil-nil. And I just realized uh, I didn't follow them much further because I was busy preparing the Jersey matchup review, uh, the uh, Jersey review, the first video. Then I realized I was wearing Argentina all day. That means Argentina loses. Voila. Not that big of a surprise, but shows my soccer pass. Anyway, England runs out winners and also through the next stage Japan at four points looks pretty strong because you know four points even if you end up in third place that gets you. Uh, Scotland don't think will make it. Uh, Argentina if they can get a point against Scotland or uh, even a win then Argentina sensationally would move on. But games have to be played. Anyway, let me know what you think about uh, the games today. Um, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of these. And I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that might be of interest to you too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will give you all the updates on my channel, all things My Soccer Universe. And with that, I want to wish you a wonderful day.